Pennsylvania joins the nation in recognizing National School Bus Safety Week. There are common challenges bus drivers face that's impacting safety in our region. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Rogers explains. Carol Danko begins each morning stepping onto her bus and taking on a big responsibility. She buckles her seatbelt and now holds the safety of 40 children in her hands. It's very frightening. These are children. These are children who think they're safe on the bus. They run off the bus. They're just not thinking about their safety. They expect other people to be responsible for them, and sometimes they're not. She says the biggest issue they're seeing here in our area is motorists not stopping when the stop arm comes out and the red lights are flashing. Sometimes they even come up on the right side of our bus when we're unloading children. More than once I've had to grab a child and pull them back. In Pennsylvania, motorists must stop at least 10 feet away from school buses that have their red lights flashing and stop arm extended. If they don't, they could face a $250 fine, five points on their driving record, and or a 60-day license suspension. Plenty of important laws to follow here. What happens if motorists break these laws? Um, when a motorist runs our let reds, they're able to hit somebody. A few years ago, we had a crossing guard get hit, um, and it literally ended her life. And it was detrimental not only to the driver and the children on the bus to see that, but her family too. A big responsibility bus drivers take on every day. It's why they take the time to get to know each student who enters their bus. It's important because you know who belongs where. Uh, which parents are normally there at the stop. You know, even if it's a third grader and mom and dad are normally there and the driver gets there, mom's not there. Normally a third grader would get let off alone, but the driver knows enough to call into the office so we can call mom and say, is everything okay? During this National Bus Safety Week, they say, take a moment to think about the children who you could be putting at risk if you break the law. In Wilkes-Barre, Nicole Rogers, 2822, Eyewitness News. And you can go to PAHomepage.com for a full list of Pennsylvania's bus safety laws.